I called this record um, Forget the Storm because for the last, I guess, six years or so, I was working on a record at Warner Brothers called The Storms We Share. And I made this record about, I don't know, five times. Yeah, there's no way to explain it, but either way, you know. And, and, and finally, I just ended up scrapping the whole record. At the end of the day, I was like, I, I'm probably going to quit this business if I don't do it my way because I'm just so frustrated, you know? Okay. So I called this record Forget the Storm in reference to that record and just forgetting all that stuff that I left behind. I got my band together and some friends. I said, let's record it. Let's not think about it. Let's do it really quickly. And nobody second guessed anything. And we did it. And then before I knew it, I had like this record in my hand with a photo and it said Forget the Storm. It was like, oh my God, did I make this thing? And I think that's what I was picturing when I was singing into a hairbrush, into the mirror when I was a kid. That kind of record, you know? So. And I got nothing when you smile like Mona Lisa. Cause I need you, I need you tonight. Like there's, there's so much honesty in the record that it's, like, it's jarring for me, but I also want it to be the template, you know? Prince of Nothing Charming and Kicking My Heels, those are all songs with lyrics that I'm like, I don't know if I want fans to know that about me, but then I'm thinking, well, what am I doing, you know? Loaded Gun was like a song that I have been wanting to sing, uh, that kind of song for so long, and I think there's a huge part of me that wants to do that, and that was the main thing that I would never be allowed to do at a label. There are people that I've known for like years that will probably know me about the same or not even as close to somebody who listens to this record straight through and knows all the lyrics. My fans are like really important to me. They they like set the tone for the night for me. Every night they set the tone of the songs. They, they sometimes they, but without even realizing it, they give me permission to be a certain way. Performing is, um, you know, equally a, a favorite part to me, if not more. It's like an absolute dream come true, and it feels like a one, one in a million opportunity. And probably once a night when I'm on stage, it hits me like I'm doing it, and that's. Awesome, you know, really cool. Say,